Hello ladies and gents, Dave Murden from Oak Tree Motorhomes here. I'm just going to show you around this lovely Burstner Argos that we've got in stock. A 2007 model. Now, uh, Burstner is one of the world's leading manufacturers, uh, so the build quality is really high throughout. Uh, good material selection, etc. Really well made, fully winterised motorhome. Uh, it's got the double floor as well. You can see one of the access lockers just in front of the habitation door, uh, which leads into the double floor. So loads of storage space in here. Proper six berth family motorhome. Uh, we've got a reversing camera on the rear already and a roof access ladder. And you can see the roof bars as well. Uh, nice big canopy. I think I'll just show you inside the garage before we carry on. Now you can see we've got extra security locks on all of the all of the doors, habitation door, all the locker doors, etc. I'll just open the garage for you. So we'll just have a nice look in there. So it's a huge garage in one of these if you haven't seen uh, one before. And you can see you can access it uh, with full-size doors on both sides of the garage. <coughs> Now, as it says in the listing, uh, this one does have a couple of marks and ripples in the side. I don't know whether you can see them there. They are quite minor, uh, but it has had a large effect on the value of the motorhome. Uh, so you can save quite a lot of money uh, by buying this one. As you can see inside, it's in lovely condition. So we'll start in the rear. Uh, so we've got the rear fixed bed uh, over that generous garage that we just had a look at. Uh, you can see we've got some storage cupboards and shelves and bits and bobs. But just swing around, you can see we've already got a TV fitted uh, on the TV bracket here. Uh, completely separate shower unit here. Nice tidy shower unit. Uh, large cupboard. I'll just show you that nice large storage cupboard that we've got here. Uh, and then we've got a hanging pole up at the top there. Uh, so then you've got a bit of hanging space for your clothes. Then directly opposite again, we've got the washroom. That's a nice washroom. Again, everything nice and clean and tidy inside. Bit of storage space underneath the wash basin there. And then we've got a storage cupboard up over the top there. Uh, this is one of the radiators for the old wet heating system, uh, which is throughout the motorhome. A lot of motorhomes have got a blown air heating system, uh, but this one's got uh, a wet heating system, similar to your radiators uh, you've probably got in your house at home. Just before we move on, I'll show you that once you open the washroom door, uh, it closes the rear bedroom off. Uh, so that effectively creates your nice ensuite bedroom uh, in the back. Excellent for when you've got family with children. <clears throat> so moving into the kitchen, nice size kitchen, plenty of storage space uh, down there, plenty of storage space up over the top, uh, cooker extractor there to take away the cooking smells, uh, generous size sink with integrated draining board there, uh, domestic style hob uh, with four gas rings, <clears throat> got a separate grill uh, and then a separate oven, all nice and tidy inside there. And then directly opposite, uh, we've got this nice large fridge unit <coughs> with a completely separate freezer compartment. And again, you can see it's all nice and tidy in there, well looked after. <coughs> a little bit of a glasses um, cabinet there for your drinks, glasses, etc. Uh, and then if I just swing around opposite here, this roller shutter door has already got a TV bracket in uh, with a TV in there. And that just slides out uh, so that can be viewed from in the dining area. Nice, lovely, spacious dining area here. Uh, looks like it's been reupholstered at some t some point because the upholstery uh, looks quite modern and it's in fantastic condition. <coughs> so you've got the uh, double dinette here. A uh, great thing about a double dinette is you've got your two seat belts there, two seat belts there, and then along with the cab seats, uh, you've got six properly belted three-point seat belts. Uh, so there's a bit of storage space underneath uh, the bench seats at the back there. And we've got the overhead lockers, uh, both sides. Uh, and then to complete this into a proper six berth family motorhome, uh, we've got the over cab bed as well. Nice, generous uh, over cab bed there. Lovely big panoramic skylight up at the top as well. 
Uh, just show you that we've got the cab, the door into the cab. Uh, this door will close completely to close the cab off. With this being a proper winterized motorhome, uh, the cab's not brilliant uh, insulation wise. Uh, so this door's really handy on the colder times of the year for shutting the cab off completely. Just show you there where the rear view mirror uh, usually is. That's where your reversing camera is displayed. So nice and convenient for when you're reversing. I think it's something you really need uh, for a vehicle of this size. So it's in lovely condition inside this motorhome. <coughs> Uh, so if you'd like any more details, just give us a call on 01159 303 140 and any of our sales team will be happy to help. Thanks very much for your time.